Avam back again with another episode of Dragon's Dogma. In the last episode, we met the Duke. And we met his Chamberlain, Aldous. And we're going to start taking directives from Aldous to help us get closer to defeating the dragon that took my heart. As I said in the last episode, if I get enough likes on this video and some good comments, I will start all the way back at level zero and play through the entire game from start to finish and on to Bitter Black Isle, the DLC. We're going to take a look at where we're at now. So the current status of my character, Avam, is a level 200, denoted by the infinity sign. But right now, let's get into the directives from Aldis and see where we're at. If you notice, the pawns aren't traveling with me currently because they're not allowed in here. They have to wait outside. What are pawns? Well, they're not quite human, but they all arrive when an Arisen comes to town. So let's go into the Duke's mansion. Well, Duke's castle here. We're going to talk to Aldous. There's that little Festus bastard that put that hat on my head. Gun. Worthless. Aldous, what do you have for me? me for your assignments and no one else. Yeah, you, you told me that already. I speak for his grace on such matters. My word is his. As such, any task deserves your full and immediate attention. I'm sorry, what were you saying? I wasn't paying attention. Pray, make your choice, sir. Okay. Um, so, uh, hmm. Well, let's, let's aid the Corps on a hunting expedition first, because that, no this is an exciting mission. The roads are ever more overrun with beasts of every stripe. Yes, every stripe. Threat has only worsened since the dragon's coming. Trade has suffered. Citizens have died. All right, get on with it, Aldous. A company of the land's finest sword hands have been gathered to thin the creature's numbers. Okay. There's no perfect solution, but it is a start. I would ask you to join them, sir. Yes. There's been no end of reports of caravans bearing tribute bound for Grand Soren being waylaid by monsters. Your text box uh, left out the word being, yet your voice said being. Among them, the direst threat is posed by the griffin. A griffin, you say? It is not a creature easily quelled, but we can ignore it no longer. Sounds right. Hence the company of elites. And now it seems they are prepared to face the beast. Are they? They stand in wait outside the castle gate. Go and speak with them for further detail. I fear this may be a long battle, sir. May the Maker be your shield. All right, a long battle. Hmm. Let's see how long the battle is when Avam joins the battle. Nice roll. And out the gate. If I tried that in real life, I would have smashed my face and ran into the gate. What do you have for me? It pains me to burden you, busy as you are with the royal orders, but there is aught I would speak of with you. All right. It is a cause of worry, though I speak only for myself and not as Chamberlain. Might I beg a moment? Ah, uh, sure. Skeletons have been sighted near the capital these past few days. Okay. Elsewhere, I've had no end of reports of secret meetings among the zealots of salvation. Tell me more. I cannot help but see the two as intertwined, though I have mm. no evidence to prove it. Okay, so you're making things up and you're trying to bring me into it. Is that what you're saying? Still, I'll be damned if I allow their kind to go corrupting the minds of good people for want of evidence. Uh, which kind are you talking about? The zealots or the skeletons? Because both sound troublesome. Arisen, I ask this as a favor. Will you oh, look Simone's waving in the background. And hunt out any thread that connects them. Uh, sure. I believe I've learned where the cult meets. I've made note of it on your map. 
How did you get my map? I ask you begin your search there. Go, and learn what you can. Ah, a secret meeting. Well, there's gonna be a side quest we'll enjoy. After we take out this griffin. Let's go fight this griffin, this this terrible battle. Salvation I don't know. The knight's champion. The capital swirls with their runes. Carnival. Let's turn that one in. What news arisen? They agreed to leave. Wonderful. Yeah, I had to pay them 30,000 uh, gold, just so you're aware of that. Can can we talk about that? Requesting your aid was indeed the proper course. Now, the land may be sold without delay. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. You have done me a great service this day. Well, it wasn't this day. It was actually yesterday. I you weren't around. This is but the beginning of a long and prosperous partnership between you and I. Hmm. Yeah. Ass. Any rarities to sell? I'll pay you handsome right then. Get out of here, you bastard. Well, I made... See, I made 40000 from that quest. So even if you pay him, you pay the 30000 which is something you want to do. I cannot stress enough. When they ask for the money, make sure you have 30000 You give it to them. You only make 10000 off the quest, but you come out on top. Do not forget that, those that play the game. Let's roll. So we're going to leave the castle gates, and outside the castle gates will be said hunting party to take us right to the griffin. Now, let's see if I can do what is necessary and make this work. Because there is a shortcut to this. And let's and now it's been two years since I played. Let's see if I can see if I can do this real quick. Because this would be something. If I can if I could pull this off and remember how to do it like I used to. I mean I still remember, but I just hope I'm fast enough to do it. Let's talk to this dude. I had a feeling you might be our escort. Really? Because I'm the arisen, so who else do you think it was gonna be? Aye, we are the company of elites you're to march with. A poor jest, I know. Yeah. We'll circle the capital, striking the griffin as we come upon it along the way. Mm-hmm. We attack when it sets down. It is nothing so clever as to be called a strategy, but it will work. So you're telling me your strategy is when it lands, you attack it. Wow. You guys really studied for this. If you still care to join us after hearing all that, let's be off. Uh, can I change my mind? Uh, I mean, I, I could probably do this with just my group. All right, here we go. So here's our, uh, the, the only funny part about them not adding mounts in the game is the fact that it's like, all right, off to battle. We're walking. We're all walking. Here we go. This is us walking. Yep, this is this is us walking to battle against a griffin. Clear your mind of all but the fight. Hey, first time chat, what's going on? We're about to fight a griffin. Buckle your safety belt. This is gonna be a good one. Oh, doing great. Doing great. Oh god, there's a goblin. All right, so uh, any other guys gonna fight or here? Let, let me take care of those for you, you brave warriors of uh, Grand Soren. Just, just uh, let me let me take care of that. Don't worry about it. Make haste! Make haste! Make haste for what? We must fight. Don't worry, guys. I got this. I'll do it myself. Ooh, Sunbright. Okay, so 
Sunbright grows in the daylight near the base of trees. Moon glow grows in the evening. Ah, yes. A pile of bones. Thank you very much. Love to have some good love in the stream. Uh, so we're joining the campaign. We need to find a goblin and put it in there. Now, why don't you guys all hide over there? Let me see what I can do here. There we go. Here, we'll just pick this one up. That was a waste of time. Yeah, it was a waste of time. These whole this whole thing is a waste of time. These people are terrible fighters. All right, so I'm gonna come over here and we're gonna set this goblin down. It should attract the griffin. Yeah. All right, so we put the goblin down. Get out of the circle, everybody. There's the griffin. Here he comes. All right, now. It comes. Here we go. Where, really? This is a fine place to lie in ambush. Come on back. Come on back. There it goes. It's on fire. It can't fly when it's on fire. Don't let it get away. Damn bird. Okay, so the moment of fortune's turn. We cannot let this chance escape. Come, Arisen. So none of my pawns cast the fire. So therefore we have to go pursue it. So this is why I set one of the port crystals where I did. You take the fairy stone, you use the fairy stone, and when it brings up the port crystal, you're going to go over here to Pastorna Cavern, because that's where the griffin escapes to. Instead of having to walk all that way, we're just going to make a fast travel. And here we are. Ah, yes. The Blue Moon Tower. What a beautiful sight. So if I was quicker there, with the weapons that I had, if they would have cast fire, I would have been able to take it down and it wouldn't have even made it here. You can beat that griffin before it gets here. There are some chests around here. Desiccated herbs. Uh, Kate, thank you for stealing those. You're probably going to use them during battle and I would have stockpiled them because I like to collect things. So here we go. Uh, so there is also, these are rift stones and you can go in there and you can pick up other pawns. I have the pawns that I would like to use. Sometimes I'll switch them out, but we're going into the blue moon tower. Uh, apparently this uh, tower, though seems like it's full of defenses, is able to be entered by just four people. I don't know how we got any of that open, but we did. Um, because apparently there was a gate on the other side, a, the double door, as you see, and yet another gate inside, yet we just all managed to get in here with no issue. Seems amazing, but, you know. What are you doing? Fight! We lost a number of men. Please, sir. How'd you guys all get here already? Snow harpies. Snow harpies are a lot more dangerous than regular harpies. And, uh, they do give more experience. So, oh, silver ring. Don't you take any of that stuff. Skeleton. Yes, the skeletons do move on their own. What are we going to do? 
Luckily, I have a sword with holy light. We did manage to take on another quest and make 3,000 gold for it by destroying some snow harpies. Pick up the rift fragments when you find them, please. You guys pick up rocks off the ground, but you leave the good stuff. Oop! Snow Harpy coming down. Alright. Should have taken that one down. I don't think it will recover from that. Yeah, it did take it down. So the Harpies can be difficult in this point if you're not ready for them because they will pick you up and there are a lot of holes to put you in. We are trailing the griffin into the blue moon tower. Join me. Ooh, harp spud. Harp spud mill. Yeah, we're not... Wait. What? Oh, I forgot about that one. I'll take that. What'd you take? Uh... Oh, you can mine down there. I don't think I need anything from there. Don't fall off the edge. Skeleton sorcerers. Other skeletons. That's fine. Scrap iron. We can use that. What's that? Sometimes you can come up here too. You you can really speed run this game. Um, and I have. I might want to do a speed run at some point. But right now, I'm I'm just getting back into remembering. Uh, yeah, there's the Griffin. All right, so. And it came back with full health. Okay, let's go. We're gonna cut it. There we go. We can get through there with a couple of good cuts, and we're through it. We have another one. Yeah, I'll take care of it. Don't worry. Shoot it. I might be able to take it down here. Oh, it... Yeah, we won't even have to go up to the other part. Set its wings on fire. Alright. It's on fire. Not supposed to take off when it's on fire. Yeah, we're aware of that. Yeah, we're already behind it, so it opens the way for us to get there. Let's go this way, real quick. Is it? Is it too dangerous? I'm not really concerned. Yeah, we're gonna go this way. Forgot that it changed the camera angle, so I do have to go run down here. Man, it has been a while since I've played this game. We've made it through. Come, we'll slay it from the rooftop. All right, let's slay it from the rooftops, everybody. To the rooftops! I think I made a wrong turn, but you guys are following me. Yep. Yep. There we go. Up the stairs! There's archers up here. All right, there's the griffin. Its head is vulnerable, and the griffin is slain. That's all. Is ours. Barely worth the effort. Griffin down. Griffin down.
Let's take what we can from here because we will be able to pick up the Griffin Pinion. Griffin Claw. Griffin Pinion. I shall remain here. I ask you return to Grand Soren ahead. Alright, so we're gonna return to Grand Soren and tell them, hey, we killed the Griffin. So there are some chests around here to pick up. There is another port crystal. Uh treasure, perhaps? Terrific armor. You took it. There are large coin bags. Just being at your side fills this pole with bigger resentment. Skulls. More coins. Lots of money from this one. Lo very useful. I wonder what's inside. So we made all the money back that we had spent in the past. Let's talk to you guys. You guys already know. We need to return to Grand Soren to let them know. That's why having fairy stones on you is important. There are no mounts. It is a long journey. I happen to have a fairy stone. So we are going back to Grand Soren. It's going to take us down near the Pawn Guild. But as soon as we get down to the Pawn Guild, we are going to make our way back to the Duke well, to all this and let him know, hey, we killed that griffin. I am kind of disappointed that I was not able to kill it so quickly. There are some more quests here. Let's see what we have. Defeat the Cyclops in the Frontier Caverns. Yes, we will take that because we're going to use that later on. Yes, you heard right. A Cyclops. And those are a lot of fun. Not difficult enemies, but they're a lot of fun. So we're going this way running because inside we don't have to worry about stamina so we're gonna go tell aldous hey killed your griffin done next because we are arisen man look at the great shape that arisen is in just running all that way full speed doesn't even worry about it doesn't even worry about it Got to leave the pawns outside, though. They're not allowed in here. Makes the duke uneasy. All right, so. What? Didn't mean to run into you. Jeez. Watch where... Oh, hello. Arisen, sir? Beg pardon, sir? Yes, yes. I bear a message from Milady Eleanor. She would speak with you, sir. In private, if you please. The duke... Duke's new wife wants to speak with me in private? Some would uh, raise an eyebrow at such a request, given my lady's vows to the Duke. I trust. Uh, forgive me, Arisen. I must learn to hold my tongue around proper company. Pray, find me tonight in the Castle Gardens. All right, I shall find you in the Castle Gardens. Well. What could be going on? And why does the Duke's wife want to meet me in the Castle Garden? Welcome back, sir. Then the Griffin is defeated. Yes. Blessed relief, that. All who walk Grancis roads will rest easier for it. Uh, kinda? There's still more Griffins out there, just so you're aware. It is welcome news, too, for trade. Mm-hmm. Still more griffins. Are you not listening to what the Arisen is saying? There are still more griffins. You and the others who fought have my thanks, Arisen. You're welcome. There's still more griffins. All right, so that quest is completed. All right, let's see. Where'd that knight go that was walking around with the yellow thing? I think he's on the second floor. I want to see what he's doing, because I remember there's something that... Ah, yes. Arisen, I would speak with you. Privately. Um, okay. This is not the place. It is a conversation. Meet me in the courtyard by night. Okay. So apparently I'm going to meet a lot of people at night in the Duke's courtyard and garden. 
Do people not have any better idea of where to meet when planning secret schemes? I mean, it just... Hey, Mercedes, what are you doing? You've made quite the name for yourself since last we spoke. Hmm. Pretty much the same name that everybody's calling me. That was good. Good conversation, Mercedes. See you later. Good talk. See you out there. Aha! Bill didn't find who I was looking for. He's in one of these rooms. Hold on a minute. We're on a mission. You're not up there. Oh. Not in the storehouse. Chamberlain's office? No. No. The Duke Sola? Hi, Duke. I'm on your desk. I'm on your desk. Look at me. I'm on your desk. Here's me. Dancing on your desk. Alright. Oh. What do you have under your chair here, Mr. Duke? A tuft of hair? Another tuft of hair? Another tuft of hair? A tuft of hair. Yet another tuft of hair. A tuft of hair. More hair. More hair. Okay, so I just searched under the uh, Duke's uh, chair where he was sitting, and um, I found a bunch of hair. Yep. Tufts of hair. The Duke is losing his hair. Could that be why he's upset? The Night Watch will begin their patrol shortly. Would be best to leave before they throw me out, eh? Hmm... Well, let's see what we have to say. First, we're going to meet these people. We have to meet in the garden and in the courtyard. Shh. Quiet. It's dark. Ah, yes, we're going to meet in the garden. In the Duchess's garden. Praise the maker you've come, Arisen. Oh, this is yeah, it was like... Most glorious. 20 minutes ago. Pardon me, sir. Forgive the ramblings of a handmaiden on a strange errand. Okay. It's only... Me lady's request to see you is a rare thing, you see. First in all my years with her, in truth. I trust you understand the delicacy of the situation. Milady is a married woman, I need not remind you. Yet, you reminded me. And well, yes, even innocent conversation could be bent foul were it discovered by others. Yeah, that makes sense, considering she's married to the Duke! Pray, walk softly, Arisen, and have a care to let none find you visiting Milady's chambers. Oh, now I gotta visit... Eleanor's chambers? Oh, God. Well, that's another night for you. Now, where's this other guy? Yeah, he's on the complete other side, so let me see if I can get around there. There is a night guard. Yeah, he's over here. If you're outside, it doesn't do you any harm, I don't think. Alright, so let's see what's I going on here. Come. You must forgive me the secrecy. The secrecy, huh? The secrecy of standing in the courtyard, looking suspicious. The matter Go on. It, I assure you. I dare not speak it aloud, so pray. Listen close. Truth be told, I have long traveled the land and You're speaking it aloud, and you have not changed the tone of your voice. My investigation has borne fruit. 
One company has amassed supplies far beyond their need. Their regimen of training, too, defies comparison. Okay. His Grace must know of this, thought I, and so drafted a letter to send the moment I found a courier I could trust. Mm hmm But fate is cruel, sir, and the pack I'd placed the letter was snatched by monsters out on the roads. Oh, no. If someone should find that missive, and its contents become known to the public, morale will crumble. Well, we don't want crumbling morale, let me tell you. What's more, a secret serves use only so long as it stays hidden. Their treason will be more easily foiled if they do not expect the Duke to know of it. Hmm. The letter must be found. Surely you understand, sir. Uh, yes. It is a quest. I would ask you to find it and retrieve it here to me. Ah. Uh, so that's what you could not speak aloud. Let's let's run this back a little bit, he says. It's so secret. I dare not speak aloud. So listen close. I dare not speak it aloud, so pray. Listen close. Let me tell you about this secret. It, normally, if you're going to say, I dare not speak it aloud, you'd say, so, let me tell you about this letter. This letter we got to find. It's very secret. It needs to come back to me. Not, I have a secret to tell you. Listen close, here it comes. Okay, so we need to find this letter. Sir, you are terrible at your job, but I will help you. Naturally, His Grace cannot openly compensate you for this task. But Naturally. I will gladly pay you of my own pockets should you succeed. Make us speed your step, sir. I was traveling the roads when I was attacked. Came from the air, swooping down long enough to snatch up my pack. Like as not carried it back to their nest. Though where that may be, I know not. The mountains near the Great Wall are nest to many a flying creature, though. Perhaps there is the best place to start. Hmm. The mountains near the Great Wall, you say? Well, I'm going to search near the Great Wall. And I'm going to open this chest. Another demon's period. Let's go this way. Hmm. Let me see. Well, it is nighttime. Let me go talk to Eleanor, if I can get there. Shh. Now this is a secret. Apparently I have to go talk to the Duke's wife. At night. It's night. probably stick out like a sore thumb considering my bow is glowing with fire. Oh, which way do we get to? Aha. I remember. No, I don't. Pick the wrong path. <laughs> Try again. Try again. Can I get over there from here? Nope! Wrong one. Take a quick route. Oh, my ankles. Now see, it is this way. Son of a gun. Treasury goes that way. Thanks for that. Take the stairs up. Flask of water, of course.
That's right. There they are. There they are. Ah, I knew it. I didn't. I forgot. But I still have the sneak left in me, let me tell you. There it is. Oh, to see the Duchess at night. Risky business. The Duchess's bedchamber. I'm going to hide. I better hide. What's going to happen here? Has come for me. Uh, excuse me. You must think me a shameless harlot. Uh, yes, pretty much. Would that words could prove my love is pure? Um, you just met me. No, you must hide. Oh boy, what's gonna happen here? So you brought the asshole with you. Eavesdrop on the ducal proceedings. I remain to stand watch of your guard, sire. For your protection, of course. <laughs> Festa, you couldn't protect anything. Uh, I think he's I drooling. Been, would you had mentioned your coming? I might have dressed more finely. Something's wrong with the Duke. My Lord Edmund, is something... Lenore, forgive me. I was wrong. I take it back, Lenore. Goodness. Oh, something to find here. A set of servants guard. All right. We better get out of here. I think he's trying to kill her. Oh no. I might have saved her life. Me under the bus. Must be made to learn, sire. Give him a taste of the lash and a stay in the dungeon. I think she just saved my Festy. life. Festy, I know you're there. My lady is mistaken. I would never violate his grace's privacy while he violates my lady's privacy. Oh, Brooke, none of your japes, fool. Summon the guards. Have this villain removed. Oh no. She knows something's up. Now, now, what have we? Friend of the Duchess, sneaking off to her chambers for a cup of tea. Must be a fine tea. What to come all this way in the dead of night? Perhaps you seek refreshment of a different sort, like a turn into sheets with his grace's own wife. Damn, you're tougher than you seem. Well, I am the Arisen after all. Perhaps there's aught to this Arisen business after all. Just said that. See, look at Eleanor feels bad. She needed my help. She needed my help. Something's not right with the Duke. Oh. What have I done? 
I mean, you saved your own life, and probably mine. But I was certain the Duke would cut me down where I stood had I not spoken so. They took all my armor, my weapons, my eye patch for crying out loud. That was covering my scar. You must run. The Duke is half mad and fears some wrath. I shall think of some way to assuage him. Here, take this giant set of keys. As is the custom at the time, of course. I better get out of here. I'm gonna pick these large mushrooms that I happen to find in my cell. I'll take this skull that I found in this other cell. I opened the wrong one. So this cell here, this is the one, open this one, and apparently they don't pay attention to things because there's a giant hole in the wall. Ooh, mushroom. Where does this take me, you ask? Skulls. I collect things. I just punched a rat. Ooh, another skull. There's a reason I'm picking them up. We use them later. I'm poisoned. Then you can pick it up in a nice little coil there. Pick it up. I can throw it. Punch the spiders. Don't worry. Take it all out. Spider venom. Rift fragments. Rift fragments. They're fine. Spider venom? Was there more? Yeah, I'll take that real quick. And uh, I can go this way. And we can get out of here. This takes us right into the slums. Where we couldn't get through on the other side. Let us make for the uh, I was uh, poisoned by a snake and uh, beaten by the Duke's guards. And we have to wait for a heal. But hey, that's where we're going to end this episode as we heal up. So we have met the Duke. We have taken down a griffin. We've met with the Duke's wife, the Duchess. And we fear that there may be some foul plot afoot. Next episode, let's find out. When we come back, we're going to change my clothes, get me cleaned up, find my things again, and we'll be right back in the battle. This is Avam saying thanks for your support. Thanks for watching. Leave a like, comment, subscribe on YouTube. Enjoy, and I'll see you the next time we're on.